hello friends and fans welcome back to another video so before starting the video i would like to request you to like subscribe and share our channel press the bell icon for more notifications so today's video is about how to download and use itunes on your computer so first of all we have to download the latest itunes software from the apple site so you have to type itunes now you will be directed to the apple website just click download itunes now and it will take you to the home page of apple itunes so you can see as on the home page uh, it will give you the different options the top one is itunes for windows so there are many options like mac windows from the store so if you click get it from the microsoft it will take you to the microsoft store so you can also download it from the microsoft store and if you don't want to download like that if you want to take some man manual setup just go back again and scroll down side and here will be the option looking for other versions if you are using the mac os you can download from here if you are using the windows operating system just click windows and you have to scroll up again and here you will see it will change it and you can now download the 64 bit version and if you are using an older pc you can also use the 32 bit so as i am using 64 bit just clicking download now and after that I have to click download again so it is giving me the downloading version just click start download and let it take some time to download So as you see that download is now finished so I'm, I'm just opening up to start the setup so it is computing space requirements so here the setup is started click next after that check out the settings like add itunes shortcut to my desktop use itunes as a default player for audio files as i don't want it as an audio player so i will uncheck it automatically update itunes and, and apple software i would like to request you to if you are the person who wants himself up to date it just check it and if you don't want any update or you are having uh, some broad mind like you want to check the feedback on the updates first and after that you want to update you can also uncheck it as i am the update freak i will just check the automatically update out tunes option click install and it will start the installation so setup is finished now just click finish and it is asking that you must restart your system for the configuration so i don't want to restart so i will just click no so itunes is starting and it is asking to accept and agree with the itunes software license agreement and if you want to read it out just read it and if you don't want just click agree and it will take you to the home page of the apple itunes it is loading up right now okay this is the home page welcome agree maximize it if you want to sign into the itunes store if you want to go to the itunes stores just click go click continue and it will take you to the itunes store and this is the main menu of the apple itunes store you can just click your phone with the itunes and you can just update it you can copy your data you can control all the settings of the phone you can keep the backup so here's a library for you browse radio 
and from the account you can just sign in with the account you are using on your iOS so this was all from today's video we hope you like our video don't forget to like subscribe and share our channel thank you